Hello YouTube. Today we are going to be talking about something pretty easy. Uh, it's changing icons on a Windows 10. Um, I know it's pretty simple, but this is centered for beginners, people who are new to Windows 10, maybe new to even owning a computer. Um, so this is going to be a short, simple tutorial, but real quick I want to take a moment to talk about my background. My background is my band, Dying of the Light. I am the drummer. You can find us on Facebook or Instagram just by searching Dying of the Light, Akron, Ohio. Uh, support the local music scene, give us a follow, and wait for music to come when we get music out. So, getting right into this video, uh, we're talking about uh, Windows 10 icons. Uh, it's actually pretty easy uh, to customize them. So, first thing you're going to want to do is just simply right click on your computer. I'm going to do it right on my guitar player's nose and come down here to personalize open that and then come over into your left menu window come to themes and then the far right menu pane desktop icon settings okay say you want to change your recycle bin icon simply click on it come right here to change icon I'm gonna scroll through here look for one. Oh, real quick before I get into that if you I'm gonna discuss more of this in a later video but say you have like a random picture of something you really want to use as a desktop icon not sure why you would but oh well you can do whatever you want say you have a picture that you want to use as an icon if you were to come in here to browse you can locate that photo and select that and use that as the icon but I'm gonna, that's a little more advanced so I'll get to that in a different video but like I said this is strictly for beginners so I want to keep it simple so you've got all this long list of icons here and we're changing our uh, recycle bin icon I'm just gonna use this caution sign right here we go ahead and click so click on the one you want and again there's tons of options big long list but anyway so I already had that selected so I'm gonna hit OK now before you close this menu pane you wanna make sure you hit apply because if you don't it won't take effect so hit apply and then you can safely close that menu and I'm gonna go ahead and minimize this for proof as you can see, my recycle bin icon is now a caution sign. Not sure why you'd want a caution sign as your recycle bin icon, but hey, it's a free world. <laughs> so, that was pretty much just, like I said, strictly basics. That's how you do it um, from this way. I'm going to go ahead and restore defaults. And again, if you want to switch back, click on it and hit restore default and I'll change it back. So, like I said, that was just a pretty simple quick tutorial on how to do that. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment and ask away. And like I said, I will go over using a picture as an icon in a later more advanced video. Because like I said, I wanted to keep this strictly for beginners. Uh, I hope you guys found that helpful. I'll go ahead and close this. And on one final note, again, I know I already said it, but give my band a follow. Um, I'd highly appreciate it. And be safe during this time. Uh, stay six feet apart from each other the best you can. Do what you can to stay healthy. And we'll all get through this at some point. And see you in my next video.